So, a griffin this close to the village? Strange. My thoughts exactly. In the forest to the mountain, sure, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn it. Come on. The Temerian lilies, they've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. Drink with Weaver Law's freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm hmm. Already had the pleasure. Ran into your kinsman, Bram. Bram? How is he? Alive. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. What can I get you? There a contract on that griffin? Nay, not at the moment. Used to be. Soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the alderman would start a collection, or go to the lord for help. Now, the Alderman don't use the privy without asking the Black One's permission first. And, it seems they hanged the Lord. So no contract. Shame. We might have done something, but not for free. Pretty busy place you got. Nations on the move. Some search for kin, others just want to get out of the way of the armies. They all need food, drink. And the night's rest in warmth. So, war's been good for your trade? Aye, so far. But it'd be best to know peace again. Times like these, you never know what tomorrow will bring. Looking for a woman. Raven-haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Thanks for everything. that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. Here. Black One's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. Better that.
I'm looking for someone. And we seek some peace and quiet. Out of my face, freak. For your breath sours my beer. Red woman dressed in black and white. Seen her? Talk. Folks say the lady rode through the village a few days back. Galloping so fast she knocked Radabor into a ditch. Which way did she go? Dunno. Lots of tracks leading off the main road. Could have gone anywhere. Oi, people! The freak's taken Micah's mind! Uh-huh. And I'll take your tongue if you don't shut up. There are four factions. Four what? Factions, teams, suits, some... What a waste of time. The Earth shall revolve around the sun before you comprehend these rules. Got a minute? Why not? Aldert Git, assistant professor in contemporary history at Oxenfurt Academy. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher, with tenure. I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. Horsewoman of war? What's that about? Folks say an omen. A beautiful phantom rides the fields at night, looks as you described her. Armies follow her, and all who cross her path meet with misfortune. I can vouch for the last bit. Know where they saw her? No, facts interest me, not fairy tales. Not a place I'd ever expect to find a scholar. Take it you're fleeing the war? Quite the opposite. Chasing it. I'm headed for the front. Tired of life? I seek knowledge, which I value more than life itself. I've a thirst no dusty old tomes can quench. I wish to see the Nilfgaardian invasion with my own eyes, understand it, and record it all in my chronicle, my magnum opus. Take my advice. Go back to your books while you can. War's no game. No faculty meetings to attend. No tenure to gain. End notes to compile. First soldier you see will kill you. Why would he do that? Me? A neutral civilian? A scholar? Boots. Come again? He'll kill you for your boots. War reached Novigrad yet? Nope. But it's only a matter of time. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other. Drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. Many a ruler's choked on that bone. True. We value our liberty in Novigrad, and we know how to fight for it. Mm -hmm. The scholars especially. The sword is not the only weapon. Do not forget, architects from our academy designed the city walls. Walls no war machine has ever crumbled. Gotta go. So long. A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man of the world. Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. But the rules are quite simple. Come, let's play. Hmm. Why not? Splendid! Here's how it's done.
Hmm. Well, it's not a game for everyone. It requires an analytical mind. If you ever find yourself in Oxenfurt and wish to play a true master, ask for Shepard. A simple innkeep by trade, but a true maestro when it comes to Gwent. I'll remember that. Thanks. everyone not like everyone and not just any woman mine smells of lilac and gooseberries dresses in black and white two schnapses it'll lift your spirits fine I'll have a drink can we cut to the chase you seen her or not Jennifer of Wengerberg Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. Into Geralt of Rivia himself, the Butcher of Blaviken. You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask, is this about love? None of your business. Yes. As a vagrant, I deserve no explanation. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night. Black and white. Gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Done drinking. Fuck off! <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Haven't done anything to you, so just calm down. Of course no. I, uh, you've done nothing. Horses work in witchcraft! Get him! Back on. 
Zaya Bath, Emperor Far That Griffin's a real scourge. Oh! Listen carefully. You'll we'll never sing that rhyme again. Never. Ooh. And you're not to play with Chetty no more. Chetty's my best mate! Chetty's a little fool who will get us all killed. I see you with him again and you'll regret it. Slower. Come on.
Tranquilia. We have much work to do here. Quite a lot. Freak. Damn deal. Stick the bark of the trees again. Greetings, good man. Having trouble with your well? That's what I read. Aye. Tis haunted. Has been for a good twenty years. Twenty? So why do you put out a notice just now? Because earlier on we drew our water from the river. But so many corpses floating in it after the battle it's turned noxious. My daughter Mandy drank half a pitcher. Felt dreadful ill. Can't keep nothing down. She grows worse by the day. Herbalist claims you fight a fever with drink. And not beer nor cider, but water. Clear, pure water. And where am I to get that if not from the well? But first, the ghost's got to be driven away. And it don't let any man near. This ghost. Describe it for me. Well, it's awful frightening. Awful. I meant, what does it look like? It looks like a woman but fresh from the grave. Wears a dirt dress, all rags, its skin flaking off its bones, and it howls like it's suffering. Some wraith, or maybe an alp. If you don't wallop it, master, if you don't take care of it, that is, it'll come kill me daughter. Fine, I'll help. Where's this well? In Havel. A settlement on the heights. It's abandoned now. No one ventures there, account of the ghost being about. Drive it off. Please. Kings do the fighting. Peasants do the dying. Hey there. 